As mentioned before, most of the time you will be writing SQL select statements. But there might be a time when you have to insert a new record into the table. For that, you will use insert statement. The way to write insert statement is insert into the table you want to insert the data into, what columns you want to insert the values into, and what values. These values have to correspond with the column names. So actor ID, actor ID, first name, last name, and last update. Go ahead and execute it, and it'll run. In order to check if the value was successfully entered, let's go ahead and enter a select statement. Execute it. You can see 201 Anil Batra last name and last updated date. 